Hey guys, welcome to my channel today. Today is gonna be a fun one. Grab yourself a snack and a drink. It might be a little long, but I haven't done a haul in a while. So let me tell you guys what I have picked up in the last couple weeks while I've been out filming and running errands. So my name is Angelique. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for stopping and watching and seeing what I have picked up. There's lots of goodies, lots of hard to find items that I was so excited that I found. But let's just hop into it before this gets too long for the intro. So we're gonna start out with, hmm. Dun, 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 dun. Let's start out with the little reindeer, Johanna Parker. I really, really wanted this last year, but could not find it in Denver. I got him at Ross $7.99. It is so stinking cute. They had, so I've seen these actually quite a few places, but she's so cute. I love that one. And then I did pick up the Santa, which I really like his handle because it's a little Santa hat. And his face is so cute. And he also was $7.99. I picked them up a while ago when I did my Ross, Ross walkthrough. If you guys saw that, you probably saw that in the video. I also picked this up the other day, I believe at Home Games. Let me see. Oh, Marshalls, $12.99. I really like it. It's got the Santa boots. He's upside down. If these toppers go much further in price, that's where my cutoff is. Even at $17, that's pretty pricey, I think. But I picked it up because I really liked it. This one I saw pretty early on. It says, oh, snap. And it's got the little gingerbread, the tree, and the girl, which I really, really was looking for. I haven't been able to see the um, jar, the canister, $6.99. Um, I think it was Marshalls or, I mean, Home Goods or TJ Maxx. Ours here are together, so. It says, oh, snap. Super cute. Well, let me start off with this first. This, guys, I'm in my front room. It's very, very cloudy and very rainy here in Dallas today, so I apologize for the lighting. But this is from Dollar Tree. I did this in a video yesterday that should go up today, I hope. Let's move some of these little mugs. But you guys, this is what everyone has been looking for. I got this actually about two weeks ago. It's got battery operated. It is so cute. It is in the $5 plus section. It is really, really cute. I'm actually doing a craft with this for a Grinch fireplace. So I think it'll be super cute, but it is battery operated. I love it. I thought it was really, really cute. All right, so now onto this little monstrosity right here. And I'm on the floor, so sorry guys. I went thrift store shopping at a new thrift store out here and ran in to find a couple clear glasses to do a collaboration with Javi. So I was trying to find those clear coffee mugs. I could not find them. So I thought I would try a thrift store. Didn't find them, but I did find this. This is, if you guys have American Girl, this, I just got to get a Mr. Clean Bar and scrub that off a little bit. It's just a sticker. The American Girl wardrobe closet. You guys are never going to believe the price I paid for this. $4. $4. There's nothing wrong with it. Let me show you guys this. The door opens. There is the bar. It is so clean in here. I did find some cute little sparkly bows in the drawer, though, which was kind of funny. But yeah, $4, you guys. Little, it's got the little cabinet over here. It's a little mirror. There's nothing wrong with this. I bought had a heart attack. They actually had the um sorry about my dog. Someone's at my door. I'm sorry guys. There was actually the Julie bed that um with the beads that hang from it. That was four dollars as well. I should have grabbed it, but I just left it. But Great, great, great find at the thrift store. It's a new one here that we found. All right. Moving on. This I found, I don't know, maybe two weeks ago at Walmart. I just was running in to grab a gallon of milk. Which, have you guys seen how much milk is? Oh my gosh, it's like $6 a gallon here almost at Walmart. Absolutely crazy. I might as well just buy a cow and get cow milk from my backyard. Come on, Duchess, you can't sit over here. All right, guys, my dog wants to come. But this one is super cute. 
I know everyone was looking for this. This is the My Life Cookie Santa accessories. It's the playset. This is the only one I found. It says Christmas countdown. It's got the little icing bag. Oh, look how cute that is. It's got the little gingerbread man and girl. The little Santa milk. You guys look how cute that is with the straw. Milk for Santa. It's got this little tree. And it's got that little reindeer dust. Oh my gosh, I love this. It's got carrots. It's got a little sheet down here. I haven't opened it up yet, but, and a little mini tree. I could not resist this. It is so cute. This I believe was $9.99. So you can kind of see what it looks like. I love this. This was so cute. It's the only one that I did see. And then, da -da -da, look what I found. I did post this on my TikTok, and I think it was on a reel. I found only one of her, and then the other two were dark, the dark hair girls. She is, I think it was $42 or $46, but I found the My Life Grinch doll. So, 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 so exciting. You guys, look at her slippers. I'm sorry. Just, I could not. So cute. I haven't even taken her out of the box yet. She's so cute. Look at her. If you guys love the Grinch, you know you know. If you don't love the Grinch, you can just get past this part if you want. But, oh my gosh. So I did see these ones. The dark hair girl. And I think another one. I don't remember what the other one was. But if you guys saw my TikTok or my reel, it might have been her that I saw actually anyways if you guys are still looking for these i have seen them still here and there um like i said she is around 46 dollars, i believe is what the price was also at the thrift store you guys i found some more ornaments they are glass but they were 50 cents the day that i got them so i grabbed a package of these i don't know what i'm gonna do with them yet i got two packages of them it's just this little mom and pop type thrift store. I'm not even, I haven't been into it, so I just found it the other day. So, all right, let's move on over to over here. I found a couple more mugs. This one is from, where did I pick this one up? Ross, $4.99. I thought this one was really cute, the little gingerbread. I thought his cheeks were really cute. I really liked that one. This one is from Target Dollar Spot. I haven't been able to find the new gingerbread one. Maybe I'll stop in there today after I went out to the grocery store and get some stuff for my daughter's birthday on Saturday. So this is the little boy one, but they were just putting the stuff out when I found him. So hopefully I can find the other one. All right, I need to show you guys, if you have a Cracker Barrel by you guys, do not miss out and stop in there. They have so much gingerbread stuff. I'm not joking. They have a beautiful gingerbread house in there. It was quite pricey. I can't remember the price. It was over $100, but it's beautiful. But look what I found. These were 99 cents. They're salt and pepper shakers. Look at how cute they are. Let's see if you can see the bottom of that. If you guys want a skew number. There you go. And these were 99 cents. They're little tiny salt and pepper. There's the boy. And then there's the girl. 99 cents. They had all kinds of them too. They had like a gingerbread truck. Stop in at your Cracker Barrel. Super cute. I found this in there. I think they probably have these at um, Hobby Lobby. Um, this was $2.49. Cracker Barrel. Same thing. Then an entire gingerbread section and then lots of ornaments. I'm going to stop in and go do a quick um, video in there. It's down the road from my house. But look how cute this is. This one was, I think, like $6 maybe. Let me see if there's a price. $7.99. This little ornament. It's so pretty. I love that one. Again, got that one at Cracker Barrel. And this one's my favorite. I only had time to run in real quick because I was looking for something specifically in there. And so I just grabbed these few things. But look how pretty this is. It's very sparkly. It's just an ornament for your tree. But I thought her skirt was really pretty. I don't know. I just thought it was really pretty. I have a white. Well, I don't have a Christmas tree right now because I got rid of it when we moved. But my stuff is like all white and silver. So I thought this would be really pretty. Hanging on my Christmas tree. 
All right, so that was Cracker Barrel. I do have a couple things from, you guys, I have quite a bit right here. So like I said, it's gonna be a little bit of a long one, but I haven't done one in a while. So stick around, guys. I got some really, really good items that I found that I literally screamed in the store because I was that excited. A couple of them I actually had to drive pretty far, so. All right, this one I just picked up. You might've saw this in my walkthrough at the 99 cent store. It's pink, it's a little nutcracker. I thought it was really cute, so I got that one. Very sparkly. You guys probably saw that in my walkthrough. All right, now, let's move on to the at-home store. I have quite a bit here. I will try to hurry, you guys. This is the pink, I couldn't decide between this one, $14.99. This one and the other one with the hat that you see everybody, it's got the little pink hat with the stones on top. I don't know, I thought this one was really cute. He's got his little staff. Let's see if you can see his little face. His little... I just thought he was really cute. I liked this one. And they're $14 a piece, $15 a piece. So that was a little bit pricey. But I really liked him because he was pink. And if you guys know, I like pink. This I picked up, I think I got this too at the at home store, yeah. This one I picked up at the at home, I believe. Or wait, maybe this is Hobby Lobby. I think this is Hobby Lobby. It's just one of those little, I know I have some of these in my storage unit from last year. It's just a little ornament. Um, these ones I believe were from Hobby Lobby as well. I thought these were really pretty. I have a bunch of angels on my tree. This is all in that like white and silver section. It's like a little teardrop, it's very sparkly. Just little angels. These were $4.99, but it was 60% off. All their stuff is 60%. So I grabbed two of those. Now, let's see. And I got, I found these actually. Whoa. These are the only two I've been able to find at the Hobby Lobby. These are just the little pink gingerbread cookies. These were $3.99 and they were 60% off. I know I have a lot of gingerbread stuff already, so I didn't want to pick up too much, just because I have stuff in storage. This one is $2.99, Walmart maybe? Not sure. But I picked this one up. I thought it was cute with her little dress. What does that say? $2.48, it's probably Walmart. I picked that one up. And then of course, I had to get her because why not? She is from the at-home store. I've been into like three different at-home stores and I haven't seen this since I picked it up. So she must be a popular one. Everybody I see has been trying to find her. I picked her up at the at-home store. I did pick up my little girl shelf sitter pretty early on. I thought she was really cute. I didn't buy the boy though. Which if I come across the boy, maybe I'll pick him up. But she's got her little dangly legs. And her super cute smile. Yeah, I love her. I think she's real cute. Her little sweater dress. So I picked her up pretty early on. And then look what I found. I had to go to three different places because the one where I live said they had it in stock, but they did not. So they were so kind to call around and see who actually had it. So I actually had to drive to Garland from where I live. This is the, it does light up. I have to put some batteries in it. But it's the little gingerbread house. It was $19.99. But it's really cute. There actually was a couple of these there. I think I did a TikTok on it or a reel maybe. I'm not sure. But they had three of these when I went in. So I was like, oh, I have to get it because it's so cute. So yeah, so I grabbed that, which I thought was really cute. I grabbed one of these little um, spatulas pretty early. With I got this when I got the girl. So I grabbed a little spatula. That's really cute. Just a spatula. Um, Four dollars for that. And I like because it has measurements on the back. I love the ones that come like that. All right. Uh, I also grabbed just some candy cane. Actually, they're not candy canes. They just the little tree picks. How much were these? I should have grabbed more of these. Five ninety nine. 
I'll have to go back and get some more of these. But they're on a really long stick. You just stick them in your tree. I don't know why I only grabbed one, which is kind of weird. I don't normally grab just one. All right, let's see. I have this little sign hanging here. Let's see if I can get it in camera here. Let it sit so. This one I actually grabbed at the Dollar Tree a couple days ago. It says North Pole Gingerbread Bakery, always fresh, made with love, bread, cake, cookies, cupcakes. This was $5 in the $5 plus section. It's just a little wood plaque. It's metal galvanized and then it's metal on the back. So yeah, so I just picked that up. Not sure where I'll put it just yet. Uh, let's see what else do we have here. Like I said, you guys look at all of this. All right, I picked these up at Marshall's. They are, let me see if we can get into this. The little containers, the tw it's 20 pieces, the food containers, but they're a really cute look. They have pink. I don't know what happens to our plastic food containers here, but there's never a lid to match or the bottom's not missing. I don't know. Do you guys have that same problem? I hate getting these things, but I always need them. So yeah, so this wasn't too, too bad. I got this at Marshall's $5.99. We go through these things so quickly. All right, let me see what I can show you guys now. I did pick up a Grinch this year at Hobby Lobby. They were 60% off. I think it was like, I don't know, $10 or something. I really like this one. With his little scruff here. I got him at Hobby Lobby. Let's see. I've just got stuff sitting next to me, so I'll just grab and show you guys what I have. I picked this up at Target. It's the little cutting board. Is that where you came from? Yeah, Target dollar spot, guys. It's the little Christmas tree cutting board. It's not super big. And then I grabbed this one. It says North Pole Hot Cocoa Served Here. This is just one of those like little serving trays. That was $5 as well. But I grabbed that pretty early on. I also grabbed, let me see if I can get to it. Did you guys see the little hot cocoa trays that everyone has? Wait, um, let me see. A little hot cocoa tray. And then I grabbed these. What else is in this bag? Nothing. All right. These I grabbed. I know everyone's been seeing this one. It has the presents in it. It says, you've been nice. That is Santa's list in the second one. And then that one I thought was really funny because it has coal in it. <laughs> I thought they were really cute. There's a better few of them. These were... $3? Yeah, $3. These are in the Target dollar spot. I've seen those quite a bit. This one I've seen hit or miss in a few different ones. I'm not sure just quite what I'll do with it for display yet, but I picked that one up. I thought it was really cute. All right, guys, we're just going to pause it right there because I don't want this video to be super, super long. I hope you enjoyed this haul so far. I have a part two. Stay tuned. Hop over and go ahead and watch part two if you guys are watching part one. I have more great finds, more goodies that you guys are going to see. So, yeah. So, thanks for watching this haul. Again, go watch for part two. Thanks, you guys, for stopping and watching. I appreciate it.